Yeah, the new Omicron subvariant presents several challenges for school districts. And Baylor Scott and White's Dr. Dominic Lucia says they will be monitoring those cases closely over the next month. But there are several things that you can start doing right now to keep both your school district safe and your kid healthy. We're dealing with it on a day to day basis. Fortunately, not in the massive quantities that we were last summer with the Delta variant or even the Omicron variant but it's still right there. COVID-19 is back, is extremely contagious, and is now showing symptoms similar to the cold and flu. But there are some things you can do right now to protect your kids before the school year starts. First, get them vaccinated. And that right now really looks like our best protection against kids getting hospitalized. The CDC says everyone five years and older can now get a booster shot if they haven't already. Second, be ready to have your kid tested for COVID. Home tests are the first line of defense, but they aren't always accurate. Lucia says you need to be ready to get your kid a PCR test in certain cases. The kid has uh, possibly chronic lung problems, asthma, they're around grandparents that have COPD, uh, diabetes, these other things that we know that COVID does not play well with, then you're going to consider getting that more accurate time consuming test. And third, Lucia says there may also be some non COVID related appointments you need to make. Making sure kids get those back to school and sports physicals. Don't wait until the last minute. Make sure they're updated on their vaccinations. And finally, this is also a good time to build healthy habits. Get your kids on a normal sleep schedule. Talk to them about good nutrition and make sure they are staying hydrated, especially during sports. Lucia says it's still too early to see exactly what COVID will look like when school starts, so they'll be keeping an eye on it. And one very important last tip, and this goes for both now and when school starts, keep your kids home if they seem to be getting sick. The latest COVID subvariant can have these same symptoms again as the normal cold, flu, even allergies, staying home, getting that test. That's going to be the best thing that you can do to keep this from spreading. Chris. All right, good advice. Andrew Moore live in studio. Thank you for that update, Andrew.